Okay, yeah, I did it. But the thing is, I did the wrong thing. I assumed red was bad and green was good, but... Of course you gotta think opposite when you're in the fucking enemy base. So, yeah. Oh, hell no. Well, this is just great. We'll start with, like, fucking... ...stunning him, I guess. Except that I got the good one and she got the shit one right there. Oh, uh, well. Nothing works, of course. I'm here. The force fights with me. Oh, there we go. No, it's screwed. The what can I do? Now that must have hurt. for the codes but I actually wonder if they're in the elevator or not and of course it's locked so never mind Let's start with this hello guys Less about to die. I mean, not yet. Wait a minute, this guy's throwing grenades. I mean, come on. That shit. I mean, I draw a lot of grenades, but this guy's fucking grenades spam. So be it. Oh. 
The force fights with me. Yes. It's here. Wow, the music is fucking loud, but I hope that's not a problem. It usually I mean. never is. But like, what seriously, um. Hmm? These guys are almost as bad as the Counter Strikes play players because. Well, not all of them, but a lot of them spam grenades. At least when I played the uh, Source back in the days. They were just nade spam me like mad. There we go. Hmm? Weapons. I guess I should take the weapons in case I need them. Never know. Never know what you might find. And I still haven't found the um, codes. So there must be a room, or there ought to be a room I haven't explored yet. But the real question is which one? And my speed is gone. God damn it. So, um. Wait a minute. Here, I've been here, and I'm not going this way. Um, wow, I'm literally confused. Not sure when that happened, but I'm not complaining. Oh, who dares to break my meditation? You will pay for interrupting my. Wait, I sense the force is strong with you, very strong. Who would have thought a force adept could be found on this insignificant planet? But your talent is no match for a disciple of the dark side. Well. That's when you're wrong. Spoken like a true drone of the Jedi Council. We Sith, however, have learned to embrace the potential of the dark side. It is what gives us strength. This meeting is a stroke of luck for me. My master will surely reward me with my lightsaber once I kill you. Yeah, you know what, whatever. <laughs> Okay, he ain't shit anyways, so I was about to say, I mean, god damn it, just stop freezing me, but I oh know, I think I can take him, yep, there we go. Wow, you get a lot of experience from that guy. And uh, no, I'm not stuck. Good. And I got something, I don't know what though, but I'm gonna check this box here first and check whatever whatever I got. See um Who looks apprentice? Oh yeah, I was supposed to do a lot of other side quests, but never mind. Cover the codes. Yeah, as I said, I get a lot of experience from that guy, but 
Im Moment. There is. I figured you'd be better. Now I know. So what do you say? I can finish the side missions or just whatever. Topics always. I'll say I. Bro this is too risky. We should find another way. Shut you up. You got another plan, sister? Or are you just objecting because you didn't think of it? No, I don't have another plan. I would rather not place my life in your hands. However, I can say the same about you. That makes us even. Fortunately, we both want to get off this rock, right? While Davik's checking you out, we steal the Ebon Hawk and escape Taurus. Come on, I've got an airspeeder nearby to take us to Davik's estate. The sooner we're off Taurus, the better. Yeah, that is correct. Wow. Listen to the music. It's just, wow. Nah, well, anyways. You summon me, Lord Malak. The search for Bastila is taking too long. We cannot risk her escaping Taras. Destroy the entire planet. The, the entire planet, Lord Malak? But there are billions of people on Terrace. We'd be slaughtering countless innocent civilians, not to mention our own men still on the surface. Your predecessor once made the mistake of questioning my orders, Admiral. Surely you are not so foolish as to make the same mistake. Of, of course not, my Lord Malik. I will do as you command, but it will take several hours to position our fleet. Then I suggest you begin immediately. You are dismissed, Admiral. Yes, Lord Malik. So, Candorus, I see you've brought someone with you. Most intriguing, if I do say so myself. You usually travel alone. It's not like you to take on partners, Candorus. You're getting soft. Watch yourself, Gallo. You may be the newest calf hound in the pack, but you aren't top dog yet. Enough. I won't have my top two men killing each other. That's not good business. I'm sure Candorus has an explanation as to why he's not working solo anymore. This is a special case, Davak. I ran into someone the Exchange might want to recruit. You may have heard something of their exploits already. Ah, yes. Now I recognize your companion. The rider who won the big swoop race. Very impressive, as was your display in the rather heated battle afterwards. You know, Candorus was right. The Exchange is always looking for new talent. You could have a bright future with our organization. With the recommendation from Candorus, and a thorough background check, you could become part of the exchange. Many would kill to prove themselves worthy of this honor. Come with me. I will give you a tour. Ah, there she is. The Ebon Hawk. My pride and joy. The fastest ship in the Outer Rim. Note the state-of-the-art security system I've had installed to protect her. The shields are completely impregnable. Nobody can get past them without the codes to try and steal my baby. Unfortunately, 
The Sith military blockade has grounded my vessel. The Ebon Hawk can outrun any vessel in the galaxy. But even she isn't fast enough to avoid the auto targeting laser cannons of the orbiting Sith fleet. I am, of course, working on acquiring the Sith departure codes so that I may come and go as I please. However, progress has been slow. But we should continue our tour. These'll be your accommodations. The slave quarters are just down the hall. If you need anything during your stay, food, a massage, feel free to call upon their services. If all goes well with your background check, you will be invited to join the exchange. I'd advise you to accept the offer when it comes, or suffer the dire consequences of refusal. You will stay in these rooms as my guest for the next few days. I will not accept no for an answer. Feel free to visit the slave quarters at any time during your stay. I must warn you, I will return. Jesus Christ, it sure talks a lot about them quarters. Okay, we're inside. No sense waiting around here, though. The sooner we get off Taurus, the better. And, yep. What? How to level up? Um... What? Let's see, what door? Which door is it? It's probably not this door, but um, I want to see what's in there. Hey! What's the. Pudu! Tuni Rama na traka donko tsercha! Chupa panko! Hello! Let's. Okay, I guess it was an honest mistake. Give me the credits and I'll for. You better pay more. Uh, no. Fuck you, man. So, I'm not supposed to go in this or I guess, but whatever. Oh. <coughs> wow. I don't know what happened, but... Say hello to Mr. No Face. I'm guessing this is the fucking slave quarters, but I'm not gonna go there. Because I have no business there, actually. Jesus Christ. Skills.
How dare you? How can... Well, I, I don't require it. Now, scurry on. The Force fights with me! Thank you. You have no idea what it was like in that torture. I don't have anything to give you as a reward for freeing me. Nothing tangible anyway. But I, I used to be the pilot of the Ebonhawk, Davik's flagship. I know the codes to disable the security system protect- You can use those- It won't be long. We've got what we came for. On it. Damn! Damn those Sith, they're bombing the whole planet. I knew they'd turn on us sooner or... Well, look what we got here. Thieves in a hangar. So, you figured you'd just steal my ship for your getaway and leave me high and dry while the Sith turn the planet into dust? Sorry, but that ain't gonna happen. I'll take care of them, Davik. I've been looking forward to this for a long time. Make it quick, Carlo. The Sith mean business. If we don't get to our ships and find somewhere safe, the bomb's dead drop and we'll kill us all. You may have me outnumbered and outgunned, but if I'm going down, I'm taking all of you with me. This thermal detonator will blow us all to bits. Damn those Sith! They'll bring this whole hangar down around our ears! Please have let them come on. Jesus Christ.
I'm supposed to be able to take this. Fuck it then. Let's see, does this work? Maybe this works. Yeah. Yes. Yes, not. Fuck. He has good. He has good items. That's why I wanted to take them. 